part that confuses most people. So you got the swale mound in the back that you're looking at there. And then the spillway is surveyed up 12 inches. So you can actually see the bottom of the swale is getting narrower. And so this edge that we're surveying in is how we determine the ultimate height that the water will sit in the swale before it spills over. So where Dakota is standing there is the bottom of the swale in the spillway section. And so we're gonna dig along that white line. And that white line is on contour 12 inches higher than bottom of swale. Which means that when the swale is full, it will have 12 inches of water that will be allowed to infiltrate in. And if we do our job right, the water coming over that white line will be perfect sheet flow, which will have no erosive force. Stay tuned for more updates.